Halloween, but I also have a surprise. I have a reborn. Thank you so much, Banggood.com, for saying us another reborn. I'm so excited to open it. And this time, I know it's a girl, so I have my girl sheet, and the names that I've picked out for her are Crystal, Christy, Caitlin, Lulu, or Twyla. So that's the names that I might do, but first I need to see what she looks like, because I can't decide a name if I don't know what she looks like. Those are the names that I've picked. Adeline Hunter, are you excited to see your new baby sister? I bet you're really excited, Adeline, since there's gonna be another girl. Yeah, yeah! How about you, Hunter? I bet you're pretty excited too, because then there's gonna be three of you, and then you can all play together. <laughs> yeah! yeah. <laughs> Let's get her opened! <gasps> oh my gosh, she's adorable! <gasps> she comes with a bear patty! Look at that! It has little eyes, oh my gosh! Comes with her birth certificate, I'll read that. And this is her certificate of birth and authenticity. And it says that she's an original and a limited edition doll. Just like Hunter, she's silicone vinyl. And she was designed exclusively for NPK Toys and Gifts Company. And then there's space for me to put in her date of birth, weight and length and also her name, but of course, I'll have to figure out what I'm naming her before I can fill it out. Now let's get her open, but first I'm gonna move the box. Oh yeah, and just like Hunter, it says Mama Heart Dolls, and that's exactly the same box like Hunter. There we go, now let's open her. Okay, first I'm gonna take out the bottle. Come here, sweetie. Aw, oh, she's so cute. I need her little stuffy. There. First, I think we should get her netting off her head. Wow, she is actually smaller than Hunter and Adeline. She's like a little mini girl. There we go. Oh! Ah! I took out her passy. I need to get this out and off of her passy. And she doesn't come with any plastic on her arms because I could just feel it. And that's her little passy. And like I said, it has an adorable bear on it. And I like how he's smiling. And of course, it's magnetic. Just look at her. She's so cute. I love her. And then she also comes with a bottle. And this has a monkey on it. And I just love the monkey. Because you know this channel, we love monkeys. I think they're so cute. And Hunter's had a tiger on it, but hers is more girly. Then she has a pink cap, which is exactly like Hunter's, but his was blue. And then she has a little stuffy. And then this actually looks exactly like her shirt, like the pattern right here, because it has the gray heart, the yellow heart, and the pink one. And then this has the gray heart, the yellow heart, and the pink one. So they're matchies. But I think her stuffy's really cute with the little pink bow. And then on her shirt it says, baby nurse, so it looks like she is pretending to be a little baby nurse. And also, I really like her little bow in her hair. Well, more like her flower headband in her hair. It's so cute. Oh my gosh! I didn't realize this before, but I just noticed that she has a little ponytail. She has a little ponytail behind her flower right there. Oh, that's so cute! And her hair is really long and brown, and it's silky like Adeline's. But I'm just surprised that she's so small. I thought she'd maybe be like the size of Hunter. My mom just told me that she's a 17 inch, and that Hunter and Adeline are a 22 inch, both of them. So that explains why she is a little smaller, but still, she's so cute. I just can't stop saying that she's so cute, cause she is. So it actually is sort of cool because it almost looks like she has glass eyes, like Adeline and Hunter, and then almost like real eyelashes. Like they totally look exactly real. And she also has some adorable little lips. And her skin is just as soft as Adeline and Hunter's. Come here, sweetie. You're so adorable. It actually kind of feels 
weird holding her because I'm just so used to having my hand down lower for Adeline and Hunter, but she's just a wee little peanut. Mama loves you. She'll probably figure out her name, but I think I already know which name I'm going to do. I think I'm going to pick Caitlyn, because she looks like a little Caitlyn to me. Do you think she looks like a little Caitlyn to you? Because I think she does to me. She's adorable, though. Well, let's change her so I can take her diaper off and put a new one on and put her in a different outfit, like a onesie, like Adeline and Hunter, because, well, it's a little warm outside right now, and I don't think she needs to be wearing a sleeper when it's a little hot out. So I'll change you, baby girl. And then I'll show you their lunch routine. And I'm grabbing some baby powder because um, I powder Adeline and Hunter and it helps them to be not so sticky when I put their clothes on, but I don't do it all the time. I just do a little powdering and then that's all. All right, well let's get you undressed. I have two sizes of, of a diaper. I have a newborn and then a larger one. I'm gonna try the large one first. Yeah, not working. <laughs> Look at how big that is on her. That's ginormous. Wait, actually, if I line it up proper, yeah, that's like halfway up her body. No, not working out. You're not wearing that. That is way better. That fits. And it also has a cute little animal on it. I think that might be a peacock. And if this newborn one doesn't fit, I have a preemie size that I can put on her too, which is if this doesn't, but I hope it does. But I need to unstrap her in the back because there's a little Velcro. There we go. Now I can get this off much easier. Oh my gosh, look at her arm, it's so e. Oh, it's adorable. Yeah, can you hear me? So you can see that she's a suede body, just like Hunter is. Whoa! It looks like the Velcro was stuck to the diaper that she had on. <laughs> oh, this stuff actually looks pretty comfy. It's very soft on the inside and outside. She can wear this to bed tonight, but I don't think we should worry about that because it's not even close to bedtime. It's lunchtime. Let's fold that up neatly. I really like Caitlyn. She just looks so precious. She has exactly the same blushing on her arms and knees. Look at how itty bitty her arms and legs are. They're so wee. And her nails look painted like a real nail. Same with her toenails. Let's change her diaper. This diaper is huge on her. Ah! There we go. Well, baby girl. You need to get your diaper on for a sweetheart. Which is before I can get you dressed. Yeah, this newborn fits you perfect. Here we go. And the newborn fits pretty well. It's just a little high, but I think if we did the preemie, it might not fit. Like it might be too small. But what I do when it's like too high up in the front and back is I just fold it inside of the diaper. And now as you can see, it fits perfectly on her. And guess what, little Caitlin? I have two outfits that are your sisters and I think I should ask her which outfit she thinks you, little adorable sweetheart, should wear. So I have these two outfits. I have the striped one and then this owl one. Adeline, which outfit do you think she should wear? Stripe. Stripe? All right, well, Caitlin, which outfit do you want to wear? Owl. You want to wear the owl? All right, Adeline, it looks like she's going to wear the owl, okay? No, stripe. Honey, I'm sure it's the little owl. I'm like the owl. I want that. Well, sweetie, you already have owls on your shirt. You have the mommy and the baby. And you have a whole bunch of them, Adeline. That one had two. Just make me new. I promise you that next time you can wear it, okay? And you have the exactly same owls on your shirt. Like mummies and babies, but even more. So you should feel extra special. It can be matchies, okay? Okay. Good girl. Owls it is. Do you want a little foot? 
I'm pretty sure that this will fit Caitlyn because she is pretty wee. Hey, aren't you pretty wee, little Caitlyn? <laughs> yes, you are. If it doesn't, then she's probably gonna need a newborn. Cause this is Yoda three. Let's snap you up, little Caitlyn. There. <laughs> She's so cute. <laughs> yes, you are, little Caitlyn. And your little flower headband goes perfect with your outfit. It's matching pink. I've had so many ask where I've got Hunter and Adelaide, and I bet there's gonna be so many who's gonna ask, where have you got little Caitlyn? If you like being good reborn just as much as I do, like Caitlyn and Hunter, please check our video description for a link to the banggood.com website where you can shop for a reborn just like Caitlin and Hunter for yourself. I'll also leave a link to Pumpkin Doodle Babies where I got Adeline. It's so cute on her, I love it. But I might need to find um, one size down because as you can see on the arms it's like very long and here it's like all crinkled up because I had to pull it down so then the owls wouldn't get crinkled up. I'll take off her adorable flower headband so I can show you what her hair looks like without it and also so I can see but I have to put it back on after because she looks so cute with it. There we go. Whoa! A little crazy. There, that's what she looks like without her headband. And like I said, on this side, she has a little mini ponytail. So cute. Adorable. I have to say, I actually like her with her hair down and up in the flower. So maybe I can have her wear her flower in the day, and then for bed, she can have her hair down. There we go. Perfect. There. Well, now that your cute headband's in, Mama's going to go and make your bottle in love with Hunter and Adelaide. Hmm? There. Sing right with your brother and sister. <laughs> Maybe you can have your toy. Or it's more like a stuffy. There you are, it's good. <laughs> oh my God, you look so adorable all together. Especially with little Caitlin in the middle. Okay, well you guys, Play nicely, and if you want to switch toys, that means you have to share, okay? Mommy's going to make your guys a lunch, okay? I'll be back to check on you in a minute. <laughs> okay, let's start with our bottles. First, I'm going to do a little Caitlin. So what I'm going to make for her is some tropical juice. I start by filling up the bottle with how much water I want to give them, and then it's the perfect amount for what I want them to have. I might do just a scoop of water. That's good. All right now, I need to pour in the water. There's the juice. All right now, I need to set the time. Not there. This looks delicious. It's a really dark purple. It's actually a very pretty purple. Oh my goodness, I hope Caitlin loves this. Here we go. Caitlin's is done. Let's do Adeline's. I'm going to do, whoa, mango juice for her. It's one of her new favorite flavors. Just when I think I know what her favorite flavor is, then she switches her favorite flavor, and this time it's mango. There's the water, and now the yummy mango juice. than the last time I made it for her. Oh my gosh, it's stripped everywhere. Here's the mango juice. 
last time when I made it for Adeline, it was more yellow than orange, let's say. But now this time it looks more mangy. The last time it looked like banana. She doesn't care for bananas. That's time for Hunter's. So the flavor I'm making Hunter is blueberry. I think I might use the rest of the water for him. Or maybe I'll do the exactly same. Yeah, I'm doing the exactly same what I did for Adeline, which is three ounces. Alright, time to add the juice. Whoa, this is really dark. Oh my gosh, it is spinning. <laughs> now it's time to pour his blueberry juice in. Looks so delicious. All of their juices look so delicious. Next, I'm going to move on to making their oat cereal. I have it right here. I'm going to make one big batch and then I can split it up between the three of them. But I think I'm going to use Adeline's spoon because it's the biggest. It looks like candy cane mix every time I look at it but it's not. And a lot of you have asked me what this is. It's just Gerber oat cereal for babies. And Adeline and Hunter love it. It's strawberry or raspberry flavor, but it has yogurt in it. Well, there's one thing I hope now that Caitlin likes it. Okay, now it's time to mix it. Oh my goodness, it's not getting some of the stuff on the bottom. Let me just give it a quick stir. There we go. That, you can hear all of like the, the powder in the bottom. I'm just gonna add a little smidge more of water. There we go. Now mix this. Oh my gosh. <laughs> It looks a little like jelly. There. There we go. Should be good. <laughs> Look at it made indents on the mixers. <laughs> First, I'm going to do Caitlin's. Since she's so wee, I might give her one or two scoops because she's so wee. And there's Caitlin's. Now I just need her little spoon. She is an itty bitty spoon, so she's so itty bitty. Next is Adeline's. And I have her spoon right here. I think one and two scoop is good because then there's just enough left for Hunter. There. And that's Adeline's. And finally, Hunter's. I like his spoon because it's like, it's sort of rubbery in the front. I'll just give him the rest. Hunter's a growing baby boy and he has a really good appetite. When it comes to this oat cereal, <laughs> Adeline and Hunter love this stuff. Okay, all their lunch is ready. I'm so excited to see if Caitlin likes her tropical juice and her oat cereal. I know Adeline and Hunter are going to love it. They eat it all the time for lunch and dinner. I gotta put all of it at the table and then it's time for them to eat. Lunch time. As you can see, Adeline and Hunter have already started eating. They're sort of picking up now on how to eat by themselves. So I'm really proud of them. And I forgot. Um, I said that I'd powder Caitlin and show you I'd powder them. But I forgot because I was just so excited to open her because she's so cute and adorable. And I forgot. So next time I do a video with these three cuties, I will show you how I'm going to powder Caitlin, Adeline, and Hunter. 
So I have some medicine right here, and I don't know if you saw my video where I took Adeline and Hunter to Dr. Pepper's clinic when they were sick. So Adeline finished all of her medicine that was just for her, but they still have a little bit left of this. So I'm gonna give them that right now. And this is just for Adeline and Hunter, cause Caitlin doesn't need it, cause she wasn't here by then. All right, Adeline. Open up. Here you go. Good job. Yucky. I know, you don't like it, Adeline. <laughs> but it's helping you to get better. Right, Hunter, buddy? You're next. There we go. All right, Hunter. Here you go, buddy. Mmm. Yummy. You gross, Hunter. Adeline, he's not gross. He just likes the taste of it. There we go. Okay, Hunter and Alan, you can keep eating. I just need to help little Kate and me eat. Mm. Good job, Hunter. Mm. Not too much. Mm. Take it slow. Mm. Mm. Good job, Adeline. All right, Kate, it's your turn. Try this. I hope you like it, huh? Here. Mm. It looks like Caitlin likes it. Mm. Well, you like it. There you go. Nice job, sweetheart. You're just like Adeline and Hunter, you love it. That makes it easy for mommy making lunch, because then I don't have to try and make what you need to eat and Hunter and Adeline. Mm -hmm. I guess we could maybe do this in one more bite, but that would be too much for you. There you go. Mm -hmm. One last bite, sweetie. You're like a big girl, Caitlin. <laughs> wow, honey. Oh my goodness, she ate it all. Look, Caitlin. See, you did eat it all. Such a big girl. All right, well, here's some bottle. <laughs> wow, it looks like Caitlin likes her tropical juice. <laughs> wow, Caitlin, great job, sweetie. Mama, help feed in the mango juice. Of course, Adeline. You spilled the little on your bed, but you did a great job. Here, I think I can make this last one into one bite. Mm -hmm. Great job, sweetie. Here, Mommy's just gonna try and scoop all the excess off. Last one. Mm -hmm. Great job, Adeline, you finished. Time for your bottle. All right, Adeline. Great job, sweetie. Did you have enough? Do you want more? Mm -mm. All right. I'm going to feed your brother. All right, Hunter. Wow. You have a little mess on your face. All right, Mom. It's going to clean this up. Hunter, I'm going to go and grab you a cloth, all right? Okay, buddy. I have a cloth. Up. There you go, buddy. All right, one more bite. Come on, buddy. You want some more? Mm -mm, I'm full. All right, well, you had the most and you did eat a lot. You must have been real hungry. Got some bottle? Yeah. All right, there. <laughs> Wow, buddy, you've ate the most and now you've drank the most. Wow, you must be growing. All right, Hunter, up your face. Here we go. <laughs> you got some on your cheek. All right. All done, good job, Hunter. Is that better? Yeah, that looks better. You do your bib. Ooh, I got it on my hand. All right, Adeline, now it's time to take your bib off. That's a great idea, Adeline. I'll just finish cleaning up Caitlin. I'll get your bumps changed, and then we can go to the park. We'll see what Caitlin thinks of the swings. Oh my goodness, I have my hands full of these three little cuties. Thank you so much again, Banga.com. I absolutely love Caitlin. 
He's so cute. And all my other reboards. Hunter and Adeline. I better go and get their bums changed and then we can all go to the park. Yay! Bye guys, see you next time. The end. Thanks for watching. To join all the fun up in our treetop, please subscribe to Little Monkey Media's channel. Don't forget, if you like our video, please share it and click like. We go bananas for monkey and